Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. Hi guys and welcome to another Fool of the Week. This week's Fool is a nasty Daily Mail columnist who goes by the name Amanda Platel. I've never heard of her before, which is wonderful. Anyway, she went on the attack here saying that rubbish piling up on the streets of Edinburgh is embarrassing for the Scottish First Minister, Nicola Sturgeon. But wait till you hear the insult she had for the SNP leader. Have a listen to this. Wow. Um, it is very depressing news. Yeah. Um, and, uh, and, and we've got a lot of ahead of us. Um, there's no escaping the fact we've got a terrible cost of living crisis. Um, I just don't know where you go in this, Dan. I don't know where you find any hope. I did find one thing that gave me great hope, actually. Uh, that was the fact that um, with this huge, uh, this union strike in Scotland, which started in, mm. started in Edinburgh, um, is that now that the streets are getting infested with rats, and did you know... <laughs> oh, no. Where, where, this going? where is she going with this? <laughs> did you know that a rat, from the moment it gets pregnant, has up to 12 babies in 12 weeks? So in, by the end of August, now that all the litter's been all round, the whole place is Nicola Sturgeon, that overstuffed little haggis, is going to have her whole country infested with rats. I mean, the, 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 the problem I is... I don't know how even how to respond to that. So, first of all, the suggestion that this is wonderful, that bin men are on strike and that the streets of Edinburgh will be covered in rat, will be filled with rats and that the entire country will be covered in rats. And she's seeing this as something positive. Okay, one small problem with all of this as well is that the city she's talking about, Edinburgh, the capital, is not actually run by the SNP. You can see here on the right... The administration is Labour, which is supported by the Liberal Democrats and the Conservatives, and the opposition parties are the SNP, Greens, and two Labour councillors. So I'm not sure how this is some sort of indictment against Nicola Sturgeon. Now, if you want to argue about the uh, the striking bin workers, okay, well, you know, I don't know the ins and outs of that, but to focus on the rubbish piling on the streets of Edinburgh and saying this is a problem for Nicola Sturgeon when she when her party doesn't run the council, I think it's sort of missing the point. But then this is the sort of attitude you get from these Tories. And she's a Tory. She's a supporter of Boris Johnson, supporter of Liz Truss now, and she writes for the Daily Mail. And these people are trying to convince the people of Scotland, no, no, your place is in the Union. Now, some of them probably will say, we want to get rid of Scotland because it costs us money or something. But most of them are claimed to be Unionists and they don't want Scotland to become independent. And day in, day out, their entire, entire modus operandi is to insult the Scottish people and laugh and joke about rat infested streets i don't even know how to respond to this and this is why she's our fool of the week see you next time for our next fool of the week <laughs>